All right, so um, I'm not really giving much away here because I did a I did an earlier video and it's pretty long. Like there's it's going to be a couple parts. So part one is probably like 20 minutes. Part two is going to be probably like 15 minutes or something. Anyway, so I found a cassette tape um, that turned out to be an answering machine tape, but I didn't know that at first. It was in a cassette recorder. I found it at Goodwill. And I bought it just because it looked like, um, you know, it had been recorded on. And I was kind of taking a risk, wondering, okay, well, I wonder what's on this. Because um, the tape recorder that it was in, it was one of those tape recorders that looks like they may have recorded something on it and talked, or you know. Anyway, so this is just a small portion of this conversation that really doesn't give much away. <laughs> But I did a live uh, listen where I had no idea what was on it um, when I first started playing the tape. But I'm uploading that. It's going to take a while. My computer's kind of fucked up. So I can upload this on my phone. So I'm going to give you a short clip from the middle of it. And hopefully that this turns out okay. You can hear what um, they're saying. But this is not giving much away but it's still really weird and obscure and this tape is amazing the conversations are like phenomenal anyway this is from an answering machine tape okay mm. uh, i was thinking maybe we should meet sunday because i gotta do my laundry too and i don't want to leave that bunny alone for two days I don't know. It's, such a, it's going to be such a stress. What do you think? Um, should come tomorrow. I don't want to be that, leave the bunny. You, yeah. I know. I just don't want to leave. I would like to. I just don't want to leave the bunny on for so long. You know? I kind of feel sorry for the phone is going to ring. And... Oh, yeah. Huh? What? For the bunny, for the bunny. Bernard. Take the bunny with you. I can't carry him around in the city. You'll like, be alright. Yeah. I feel, I feel utterly feel sorry. You know what Chris said, my boss? She said, animals, you know, if you have too much screaming, they can die of that. I didn't know that. They, they can die if you scream at them? Yeah. Like, you know, they get like something like heartbroken and something like that. Oh. I didn't know that. That's weird. Yeah. Okay. Because he's like really scared, you know. He get you can tell he gets more scared because the louder house gets. Okay, give me address. <laughs> okay, there you go. That's not giving much away though. There's a lot more coming up.